Hi guys, welcome to again to my channel. My name is uh, Marlesa, and today I'm gonna be uh, show you the uh, the way uh, of exporting ETAPS results to CSISF for foundation uh, design based on the, the European uh, and Ethiopian building uh, code of uh, standard uh, for the uh, previously uh, uh, modeled uh, and analyzed Tion story. Building in the previous uh, two tutorials, I have already uh, shown you uh, the way uh, of uh, scaling the uh, dynamic base here with reference to the static base here. So, if you are uh, a new member for this channel, don't forget to subscribe my channel. And if you subscribe my channel, uh, you will be getting more relevant tutorials which have already been prepared with reference to the uh, detail. Uh, analysis uh, and uh, designing of uh, high-rise uh, building structures based on the Ethiopian and uh, European building uh, code of standard. And if you are uh, also a member of this channel, uh, don't forget uh, sharing all my videos to your friends so that your friends will be uh, getting more relevant tutorials which have already uh, been uh, prepared uh, with uh, reference to the Ethiopian building code of standard and the European uh, building code of uh, uh, a standard for uh, high-rise structures. Uh, so uh, uh, just don't, don't forget also pressing the bell icon uh, so that you will be getting uh, the uh, 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 an immediate uploaded videos. And don't forget also provide me uh, the uh, uh, questions and comments in my comment box. Uh, so that I will be uh, trying to answer your questions and comments as much as possible within a short period of time. So uh, uh, let's proceed to the, today's tutorials, which is uh, the way of exporting GitHub so results to CSI for foundation design based on the European and Ethiopian building code of standard. Then now let's proceed. Just to go through the previously analyzed. Uh, uh, journey and uh, story uh, building based on the Ethiopian and European building uh, code of standard. So, uh, before uh, exporting all the results to the CSISF, uh, uh, we uh, uh, have to be sure that uh, all the logic combinations are uh, properly uh, uh, combined uh, as per the Ethiopian and European building code of standard for uh, the simplicity of uh, interpretations of uh, uh, the uh, foundation uh, design results. So just to do this, uh, go to the define menu and go to the multi combination list here. So uh, I have uh, uh, such kind of uh, combination. Uh, so uh, just I have already shown you the way of uh, the combination of such kind of load in the previous uh, tutorials. So just you can go back to the previous tutorial how the load combinations are performed based on the Ethiopian and European building code of standard incorporating all the uh, the load uh, uh, pattern such as variable load uh, the uh, gravity load uh, I mean variable load permanent load motional load and the dynamic load. So uh, uh, just here we need to uh, define the uh, envelope of the uh, envelope logic combination uh, because uh, during the uh, uh, you know the design of uh, the foundation uh, the CSI should use the uh, the maximum and the uh, governing logic combination from the exported logic combination. So. In order to uh, let it up, uh, let uh, CSI select the uh, governing and the political logic combination easily. So I need to define the envelope logic combination here. Just how to uh, create the uh, envelope logic combination, just click add new combination here. So uh, just I need to. Uh, uh, envelope all the logic combination that I have already prepared before. Just just uh, add add just, just make add add and here uh, I need to select the uh, all the logic combinations here. Just uh, here I have uh, the ultimate limit is the load combinations. So uh, just uh, I need to select this one 
and you go down and then you choose a like also the second uh, uh, ULA slot combination it is for the second one it is one and just go down the third one that's you want to say the third one and go down the fourth one and go down the fifth one the fifth one and go down just like this i have to select all the uh, ultimate limit states about combinations in this combination list so i have to make this envelope load combination envelope logic combination for foundation design and here i need to make this envelope so here uh just after that just you can make this okay so be sure that all the ultimate limited states uh logic combinations are listed here and included here and here just i have already uh, uh defined the envelope load combination for uh, just saving the time just you can see here here I have already included all the load combinations here. That means the static load combinations and the dynamic load combinations. So this is the dynamic load combination and this is the linear static load combination. And even I have already included the service load combinations, however, or however, it uh, will not be the um, the the governing load combination actually. Uh, just you can exclude this and this one because it doesn't uh, it will not uh, control the ultimate limit is that's uh, 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 that combination so just you can click ok and after that uh, here after that just uh, uh, go to the uh, the file menu here and i have for uh, uh, the option of just import and export so i need to export uh, to the csi save here and that is the story as is uh, as safe version at your effort to care for just here this one so now uh, here i need to select uh, uh, the uh, story that uh, i wanted to export so I need to uh, export uh, all the results of uh, the base uh, or the basement results that is uh, base reactions. So here I have uh, three options. The first option is export floor load only, and the second option is export floor loads and load from above, and the third one is export floor loads plus uh, columns and word distortion. So the first option is uh, used for just exporting the floor loads only. This uh, can be used for the design of stuff. And the second option can be used uh, for the design of foundation because uh, you know the uh, design of foundation incorporates all the cumulative uh, base reactions and base uh, uh, results. So I need to click this one. And here click this one in order to select all the load combination here. So be sure that the, all the load combination uh, uh, are uh, selected here so here 47 or 47 uh, cases selected here and be sure that also the ultimate limit is standard combinations are selected for, for the uh, design of foundation here just click this one and 33 of 33 components selected so uh, just uh, uh, we have uh, finished uh, uh, selected uh, all the load cases and load combinations with the option of the load export here. This, one. this option can be used when uh, we uh, have a temperature load that uh, will affect the distortion of columns and works. As I have already, uh, I, I didn't have any uh, temperature load because the temperature load will have an effect on my building, so I have. Uh, already excluded it in my load cases so uh, i can uh, export the floor loads and loads from above now click ok then uh, just to go to the desktop the foundation data here just uh, save it so now open the csi save here so just open the csi save and uh, 
import all the results exported from the GitHub's. So just go to the file menu and import then this uh, save f k file types that foundation data now that is import now csi save is importing all the exported uh, uh, base results obtained from csi i mean the etaps 16. so here uh, this is uh, the uh, exported data now just i can uh, yeah, this is uh, you know the all the uh, uh, the uh, the base uh, results of uh, tyranny story building uh, uh, that is export uh, imported from the results uh, exported in from uh, items so uh, here uh, just i can uh, hide uh, the unnecessary green line so I just go to the uh, uh, the, the uh, set view option here and uh, here just uh, make it invisible and apply so that just uh, all the joints will be uh, uh, displayed properly so uh, 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 we have to be sure that all the results are uh, imported properly or not so to uh, to check whether all the results are uh, uh, imported to CSI for properly or not, mm -hmm. simply go to the uh, uh, display menu and show mode uh, as I. Here, uh, just make uh, the uh, joint mode or uh, it, uh, or uh, just you can make the framework the uh, the framework but uh, the uh, imported uh, results are the joint results, so I can select this one. So here, uh, just I can uh, select all uh, the download and the category. And all, all those, all, you, you know, all those are uh, the primary loads. That means the load cases that I have already been uh, using during uh, the uh, analysis and uh, designing uh, of. Uh, uh, uh this 20 story building uh, using etaps but here uh, just all those are the raw data just go down so i need to select results from above for example uh, i have if i select the wall above or just i can uh, display uh, the uh, results uh, corresponding to the words just apply this one here uh, this is you know the base uh, the, the base reaction mode, which is uh, uh, obtained uh, uh, due to the wall, uh, the wall load. And if I click also the water tank load, I don't have any water tank load at the base. But yes, I have it. I have already I have water tank load and apply this one. And here, as uh, the uh, I have already applied a very uh, small amount of water tank load. At the roof so it doesn't have any effect on the uh the front that is 0 0.01 0 0.01 they are very small results and uh, and if uh, i click also the soil pressure results or the water tank or waterproofing or just rzq that is aqx above so this will have a very uh, significant uh, base reaction results here just that like this one so just we can uh, view uh, the results here for example if we see this this one and uh, you know the uh, six results are displayed here six results are displayed here if i make it in 3d so here just i can I can uh, uh, make it uh, just six results that means uh, the uh, the base reaction in x direction the base reaction in y direction and the a base reaction in uh, uh, that is the vertical uh, reaction that is in z uh, direction and uh, also movement in the three axis so all six uh, results are displayed at every joint is here and also or uh, just i can make it uh, you know i can increase the font here so that uh, the results can be seen easily i'll make it eight 
So in this way, we can uh, see uh, the uh, imported uh, results one by one, or the live load for seismic, for example, if I select this one, the results are displayed here. And just go down here, uh, the notional load, you know, for, for example, the notional load in y direction, here, this one, here. No results are displayed properly, or just go down the torsion load. That is, torsion load will be, uh, I mean, the torsion, uh, torsion load uh, due to the response spectrum in x direction. Just apply this one, it's a very small result that's displayed here. Because, you know, the, and the modal load also here, just apply this one. In a very very small result that's displayed here. Just in the, in this way we can uh, uh, check whether the uh, loads are uh, imported from uh, uh, ETAPS to CSISF property or not. So this one we can this one. Okay. So uh, just. Uh, 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 make it uh, undeformed objects and make it so that it's 2D. So this is uh, all about for uh, today's uh, tutorial. That means uh, just the way how to uh, export the uh, ETAPS results to the CSIC. Uh, if you are not a member of this channel, I don't forget to subscribe my channel. If you subscribe my channel, uh, uh, you'll uh, be getting more uh, tutorials uh, that have been already prepared uh, before with reference to the uh, detailed uh, analysis and uh, designing of high-rise building structure based on the Ethiopian and European building code of standard. And if you are also a member of my channel, don't uh, uh, forget sharing all my tutorials to your friends so that your friends uh, will be uh, getting more uh, relevant tutorials that I have already prepared before uh, for uh, high-rise uh, building structure based on the Ethiopian and European building code of standard. And uh, if you have any questions and comments, don't uh, also hesitate providing to me uh, your comments and uh, uh, questions in my commenting box. So that I will be uh, uh, reply for your uh, comments and uh, questions as much as possible within a shorter period of time. Uh, don't forget also uh, pressing the bell icon uh, so that you uh, can easily uh, receive a notification uh, during the uploading of new videos. So this is uh, tutorial part uh, 30, uh, uh, which is uh, uh, just focusing on uh, the way uh, of exporting ETAPS results to CSISF for foundation design. So next time, that is a tutorial part 31, I will uh, show you uh, just the uh, detail uh, modeling of uh, the uh, foundation for the designing of uh, this uh, foundation uh, for uh, the uh, exported uh, and the imported Best reactions. So, see you next time. Bye.